three separate awards, a Hall of Fame announcement and Griffith named as the official host for next year's awards night stressing Riverina's tourism industry is red hot. The infamous Daniliquin Ute Muster has been listed in the competition's Hall of Fame after taking out a gold title more than three years running. The committee behind the event has also been rewarded with a top gong for its new Blues and Roots Festival. Those guys would just be buzzing today, but that, that's fantastic for them. And they actually took it out over Tamworth Country Music Festival. So that kind of gives you an idea of the calibre of, of events and festivals that actually enter that category. It's not just Daniliquin seeing success with the region's gold trails, which leads tourists on a trip through the gold rush of the late 1800s, winning the Tourism Development Award. Leeton's Visitor Information Centre also sharing a slice of the success, sealing a second place for its quality services. Taking home those awards, it really is an opportunity for us to um, gain some recognition for the quality of products that we have in the region. Um, and it's also an opportunity for us to showcase what we actually have in the region. While the awards are extremely pleasing, for Griffith, the spin-off from more than 250 tourism operators from across New South Wales flocking to the city, set to provide a huge economic benefit. Not only a boost for, for our economy and our operators, but also an opportunity for our, our colleagues to see what we do. And as we know, they become ambassadors and uh, we also network from that. Dean Foscarini, Win News.